Guys, Alan Paletti, professional magician here, giving my tips, tricks, tutorials, and lots of other cool magic-related content straight your way. Today, we are doing a, well, a Penn & Teller, what, well, you read the title, <laughs> Watch, watching Penn & Teller fool us with Mario Lopez. A couple of months ago, I say a couple of months, probably quite a few months ago, I did one with Shin Lim that seemed to go over pretty well. People were into it, so I'm checking out this Mario Lopez guy. I heard a lot about him. I uh, heard the act is really funny. I haven't seen it yet, so... You guys are going to get my raw reaction watching it for the first time right now. I should also thank my patrons, Mini Jordan, Javier, and Don. Thank you also very much for helping me keep this channel going. And uh, I really I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. You guys are awesome. If you guys are interested in becoming patrons yourselves, there will be a link in the description. Thanks. Okay, so I haven't seen this yet, but I hear that Mario Lopez is hilarious. That his uh, performance at Penn & Teller's Foolish was hilarious. And I'm very excited to watch this, so let's watch it without further ado. <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm so happy to be here and I want to share with you one of my favorite tricks, favorite, with salt. It's called the vanishing. My oh, I love this. He's already setting up his character. I mean, like, he's right at the very beginning, not wasting any time, kind of giving you a, an idea of, of what his character is like or what you're going to get with him, like, right off the bat. This is very... Very good performance already. Just the whole... I mean, that's thats not an accident. That's all planned. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> the, 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 so he's... Uh, this... <laughs> I, I, I have this one. <laughs> Wait, how does he do that? <laughs> if the cell doesn't work, uh, I'm going to stay like this every day. Or also I have... <laughs> <laughs> I've, got, I've got I've got to learn that one. I don't know where I would use it, but oh my gosh. <coughs> Man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. I try with this. <laughs> with this? This is for the salt? <laughs> Okay, okay. I can do the salt. My favorite trick, my favorite trick. I put the salt in my hand. It's called the vanishing salt. But for me, the important thing is not quantity, it's quality. <laughs> so let me find one. Uh, yeah. This one. I have it. I have it. Don't blink. <laughs> I put it in my hand. Still there. <laughs> One, two, three. Uh, <laughs> it's in Harada hold. <laughs> that was just for you, Alex. <laughs> still there. Oh, uh, still here. Uh, what? Uh, oh, that's I, I beautiful. Did you guys see that? Hocus pocus. Oh, I can use, yeah, beautiful. I can use the one and will be. Oh. Oh. That's some beautiful sleight of hand too. I, I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was gorgeous. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh. What is? Let me. I'm sorry. Wow. This, this is not oh, I love it. Let me, let me clean this a little bit. Oh, this is... Look at that! Okay, okay. Look at... Look at... <laughs> look at Teller with his mouth wide open. So, there's a trick in Magic called the Salt Pour. And that's what... Uh, that's what Mario Lopez is doing here. Is he's doing a Salt Pour. But he's doing it... Uh, I mean, he's totally revamped it. And, and, and it's just hilarious. My gosh. There's a... Um, my first... Uh, time I ever saw a salt pour was Fred Caps did a salt pour and it was really good it was a really good salt pour very funny uh he was in the more you know tuxedo era of magic and everything and uh he did it with the band playing him off and he kind of was like okay you're supposed to finish the trick and the band keeps going okay we're gonna play you off now and he, he couldn't go uh which it's very funny if you look if look up Fred Caps's salt pour 
but um, this is just a whole new take on it that I haven't seen before, and it's it's hilarious. I love this. My gosh. Oh, let's watch more. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. Still here. <laughs> Let me. Yeah. Oh. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Just in case there's any question. Uh, uh, stop. <laughs> It worked. I love. I love that he has like genuine surprise too. I mean, his acting is very good. You're watching him and just going. It, it looks like this thing is is happening to him. That he's not creating the thing that's happening, but it's happening to him, and he's trying to deal with it. And uh, it's that's that's a, he's got good pantomime, good body language, good acting skills. Oh my gosh, I'm just I'm just thoroughly enjoying this. Very good. Maybe let me try. Yeah. Now, oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> now, oh. 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 Let me try. Okay. Now. Hey. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this. This is very funny. <clears throat> Man. No. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. <sighs> That was great. Mario Lopez on Penn and Teller's Fool is. That was a master class in why it's important to be a good actor and to study acting to whenever you're a magician. That, I mean, like you felt for the guy like this was happening to him. You knew it was funny, but it felt like it was happening to him. He wasn't he wasn't making it happen. It was happening to him, which is I, I know I'm repeating that, but um yeah, that's an important distinction there. And his his greeting and how he came out and how he just set up, you know, the expectations right off the bat with trying to get the salt open. You just knew things were going to be not going well for him. And it just sets it up right from the very beginning. I loved that performance. That was, uh, that was beautiful. It was just so well rehearsed. And the magic was beautiful. The sleight of hand was beautiful. It was hilarious. Uh, hats off, Mar Mario Lopez. That was awesome. Uh, wow. Wow. I'll be watching out for him in the future to be sure. And uh, hey, uh, if you guys watched this video, you enjoyed it, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.